Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about the difference between providing information and providing value. One of the biggest problems in the fitness industry right now, and for what seems to be the longest time, are the prima donnas that exist in the industry that feel like the information that they can provide a client or a potential client is worth far more than the information that that client can find elsewhere. So here's my unpopular opinion. Information is free. It's free. If you've got the balls to tell a potential client that that's what you get paid to do, you don't deserve the success that this industry holds for you. You don't. And why? Because that very same question that they asked you, they could probably get the same, if not better, answer online. But they asked you. And they asked you because they want to talk to a human being about this. They want to understand the nuance that exists within a conversation around a topic or a question that they pose to you. They want to be able to ask follow-up questions. And that is the perfect time for you to establish trust and integrity within the relationship that is unfolding before your very eyes. But instead, you've got the balls to tell somebody that that's what you get paid to do. That's not what you get paid to do. If you get paid to answer questions, I want your job. Because as a fitness professional that's been in the industry for over 22 years, I've owned a couple of businesses, I've trained hundreds if not thousands of trainers, thousands if not tens of thousands of clients. What I do is I provide for my clients a light at the end of the tunnel and an execution plan on how to get there. I give them hope. I give them an actionable plan to get to whatever their goal is. I don't give them information. They can get information online. They could ask Google. They could ask Siri. They could ask Alexa. They don't need to ask you. The reason why they asked you is because they feel that they can trust you. And what would be the first thing that a lot of people do? Let them know that I'm happy to answer a question or two for you, but this is how I make my living. I've heard it. I've heard it my own two years, and I've heard it way too often. That's not what you get paid to do. You get paid for what's proprietary. What is it that you provide that nobody else provides? That's where your value is. And if your time is money, there's no better return on investment than taking a few minutes to empathetically, perhaps sympathetically, answer questions posed to you by a potential client and build that rapport from the ground up. Why? Because it costs zero dollars. Zero dollars. Even if you charged $600 an hour, $600 an hour, $10 a minute, you spend 10 minutes talking to that person. What you get in return is an almost one for one client from a prospect. You're not going to find value like that anywhere else. You're not going to find it on Facebook advertising. You're not going to find it on Google Pay Per Click. You're not going to find that anywhere. Hundreds of people visit your website, maybe. How many people send you an email? How many of those people that send you an email turn into a client? Fractional. But if you were to ask me how many people do I earn their business from having an honest conversation with them, answering their questions, giving them the time, giving them my best advice? Far more than 80%. And generally speaking, I charge a lot. And I still earn clients out of that. Why? 
because it's genuine. It's valuable. That relationship is valuable. These people came to you because they want to know you. They want the information that you have. They feel like that same answer that you're going to give them is somehow better than the same answer that they're going to get online. But it's the same damn information. What they're giving to you is a wide open door to earn their trust and respect. And what I've seen happen far too many times is that before we've even begun to answer their questions, we slide them a bill. For what? If information was all that it took, everybody's kids would be well-behaved and go to bed on time, we'd all be retired by 30, and everybody would have six-pack abs and a perfectly clean diet. But information is not all that it takes. And information is not where your value is drawn from. Your value is drawn from your process and your ability to deliver on results. And that ability does not lie within the answers to a couple of questions in 15 minutes of your time for a good human-to-human -human interactive conversation. The value is in how you put it together for that person. So charge for what's proprietary. You charge for what nobody can offer but you. Programming. Information is free. It always has been, and it always will be. Don't forget that.